Just 646 News Channel 3 is your back to school headquarters this week. It's Desert Sands Unified School District's turn to welcome students back into the classroom. Again, many of those kids are coming back to a school makeover. News Channel 3's Crystal Jimenez joins us which schools saw upgrades this last year. Construction still fills the air at Lincoln Elementary and Gerald R. Ford Elementary School, with over $113 million being spent to significantly improve schools across Desert Sands Unified School District. Some students will be coming back this year to something new, like at Kennedy Elementary School. We do have a brand new school that was completed last year during COVID. Most of our students have not seen our school. Brand new buildings classrooms. Our classrooms are beautiful and colorful. To completely new landscaping and a new kindergarten playground. We had a school that was built in 1965, so it was time to have a new school. And but it's not just the appearance of the school that was updated. We have all the updated technology for them to learn. It is just an exciting time for all of us here at Kennedy Elementary. In our construction was this beautiful new landscaping where the district took into account our carbon footprint, so we have conservation of water throughout our school. With the pandemic preventing children to walk on school grounds for over a year, the district says it's now ahead of its original schedule. The work won't stop as children make their way back. Ford and James Madison Elementary School are still anticipating the completion of new kindergarten buildings and updated classrooms, which will be completed sometime next year. Meanwhile, teachers are anxiously awaiting the arrival of their students tomorrow. Crystal Jimenez, News Channel 3.